It's the latest move towards space tourism. Sir Richard Branson and his company Virgin Galactic are unveiling their latest spacecraft. Chris Martinez shows us it's just one program aiming to take the public to new heights. Virgin Galactic believes this brand new spacecraft will give paying customers a chance to be an astronaut. It's tremendously exciting. It's been a long, a long journey to get this far. Sir Richard Branson is the billionaire behind the operation and says the VSS Imagine will have test flights this summer, including one that he will go on. This is the third version of the Virgin spacecraft. Previous flights were carried up aboard a mothership Two, one, release, release, release. and then dropped back down to Earth. Future missions will head miles above the planet's surface and allow tourists to unbuckle and experience several minutes of weightlessness. The first launch could be next year with tickets already selling for $250,000. Our plan is to build a number of spaceships and so we could maybe get up to sort of four or 500 flights a year. And, and then we will try to get it down to a price where um, as many people as possible are able to go up. Branson isn't the only billionaire reaching for the stars. Amazon's Jeff Bezos tested his latest Blue Origin rocket in January with hopes of one day taking tourists up. I'm so proud to work with such a great team. And Tesla's Elon Musk has SpaceX. One. <laughs> One of the company's experimental rockets blasted off on a cloudy Tuesday in Texas, exploding during the flight. It's designed to return to Earth, but a test earlier this month also ended in an explosion. Virgin spacecraft lands like an airplane. The company had its own crash in 2014 that killed one of the pilots. There have been many successful tests since then, and the company expects to give people an out-of-this-world experience and bring them back safely. Chris Martinez, CBS News, Los Angeles.